In an interview with Esquire magazine, Mad Max Fury Road star Tom Hardy revealed that he was signed on for three more Mad Max movies, provided the first one is a financial success. In the article, it states, As for the pressure, Hardy says it's enormous. I've never been more excited and out of my comfort zone. He's seen the film and says it's effing unbelievable. He's attached to a further three Mad Max films, though, as he says, everything's based on figures and how things are perceived. Inevitably, it's a business. Mad Max Fury Road opens in AMC theaters everywhere on May 15th. Amy Rose, what are your thoughts on Tom Hardy appearing in three more Mad Max films? Title lends itself well, too. More Fury. You know, like, you could just keep going. I mean, this is not, first of all, I'm getting really impatient to see this film. Mm -hmm. I just keep hearing schneps all yeah. it. I mean, all the people at W you be that I have friends with are just like it's going to blow your mind and they're not just saying that you can always tell when a publicist is like go see our movie it's great or when they truly believe it and this film is just bananas I love that Miller is back to continue the story that's so rare that the original creator of a franchise can keep going that's just so exciting to me using the technological benefits of today um, and Hardy's just he's amazing but that's not a surprise at all I mean they always want to lock in the actors they always want to make Make sure if and when, in this case, it's going to be a when, mm -hmm. it's successful that, okay, let's keep going. I mean, studios are in the business of making money, period. So I'm not surprised at all. But Charlize Theron, I mean, I'm excited to see what she does as well. So I'm so in. Hurry up. Yeah, I'm excited to see as well. But I don't know if they're going to make three more. I mean, he's not talking about a trilogy. He's talking about four movies total, three more after that. I don't know if Tom Hardy is going to have the same enthusiasm he, that he does now. I am really looking forward to this movie. Uh, I like Mad Max. I love Road Warrior. And I heard this is in the same spirit as Road Warrior with a lot of... Uh, I mean, Road Warrior was all practical effects, but this has like practical effects mixed with CG, but kind of it looks like a good blend. It's gorgeous. Yeah, so it looks... Fantastic. I'm super excited. I'm just not sure George Miller and Tom Hardy are going to make it to a fourth movie, Mark. A fourth one is, uh, that's that's way looking down the road, prognosticating. I think that Tom Hardy, this is really the first time he's been an integral part of a giant franchise. I know he played Bane in The Dark Knight Rises, but that's more as a hired gun coming on totally. to finish a trilogy as opposed to being the guy that's kicking off this massive set of movies. When I, I uh, saw It Follows in uh, theaters a couple weeks so ago, good. I paid to see it like a civilian, <laughs> and I'm in there, and when the trailer for Mad Max came on, there was an audible buzz in the room. People are excited to see this film. What concerns me is that it is coming out in the summer when you just have movie after movie after movie that a lot of people want to go see. So I hope it does well. The question is going to be if it does good, is it going to warrant a sequel? If it just does okay, if it has a nice weekend, then it continues to make some money, gets good uh, critical reception, do they continue down this road or are they like, eh, maybe, I don't know. So he signed on for three movies. I think that's more of a precautionary thing than anything else. Yeah. I don't know. They've had a lot of story discussions as opposed to mm -hmm. where are we going to take this once we make the fourth movie? But it's nice to know that he seems locked in yeah. to playing this character because you want some continuity from everything we've seen so far. It looks like we're all going to want more movies. Should we bet on this one too? Because I think it's going <laughs> to make a lot of this. I think now, how much do you think? How much? This this first one that's coming out in May. Okay. I'm going to go, I think it could make as much as 65 or 70. Opening weekend? Yeah. I'm going to say around 50. Okay. Okay. I'm going to go higher. I'm going to go 70. Okay. I, I, I said I think, 65 or 70. Yeah, so, so the 70, 75 <laughs> oh, then. Okay. okay. <laughs> Which is funny because this movie, remember all the like rumors about the delays and the reshoots? It's yeah. kind of like at one point people were talking about this movie possibly being a disaster. Yeah. And now everyone's like super pumped about right it. Right when they release the images, we're like, okay, you got my attention. It's not going to be Waterworld with sand. This <laughs> no. is going to be a good film. No. Okay. 